So we're back again with these motorbike injectors, back into the light. What we're going to run now is we're going to run a what's called a static flow. So for 20 seconds, each injector will open wide and see what it is capable of flowing. So we'll set about on that. <laughs> So, what we can see here, stand back a little bit, number one injector is opening. It's going to stay open for 20 seconds. We can alter the time span on this, so we can have you know, 10 seconds, 15 seconds, 20 seconds. What this is going to show us is if we've got any difference between the performance of an injector and what it can statically flow. That's with the injector wide open. What we're going to hopefully see is that they are all somewhere near each other and we haven't got anything that's crazy out. I think the moral of this story is if you've got a motorbike and it's going to be sat up over winter, just go and start it up once in a blue moon. Certainly save you the hassle of having the injectors taken out and so forth. So, there we have it. A little slight variation. This one's flown 84 mils. This one's 83. Between 81 and 82. And this one's between 82 and 83. So we haven't got any scary results. We haven't got the, the fact that one's flown 40 mils and the rest are flown in the 80s. So, you know, safe to say they're, they're within a reasonable spec those. Next thing is we'll take them out the rig, we'll put them back into the bath, run them for a, a period of time, now that they're all working, see if we can resolve this, uh, this weeping injector on number one, see if it's just a bit of debris that's in there. Okay.